The Innovation Fair is really great here in Livermore because you see there's a lot of diverse products, everything from individual makers who are making their own DIY robots to companies like us bringing you know, our products to show to VR headsets. It's quite a number of different things that parents and kids can actually experience and be part of, which is, which is really great. So we've actually been to a number of similar fairs and actually we were here last year at Livermore. And I think it's actually really great that the community gets so involved. On the weekends you see like you know, thousands of people actually coming by. And we believe that these kinds of events are really important for folks in the community to see how there's other ways to educate kids beyond just the regular school system. You know, in schools they don't always teach things like STEM, programming, electronics, engineering. And so coming to these events on the weekends are a way that parents can experience a different way of learning and teaching. I, you know what, I love seeing the kids around here get excited about technology and whatnot. It's amazing how smart these kids are. It really just amazes me. The, the machine over here to my left, I've been teaching kids that are, you know, seven, eight, nine years old, how to program in binary on the front panel of a computer that's five times older than they are. And they pick it right up. We came up with the idea to do a VR theater because we thought we'd bring a draw for Livermore residents to come to the event. And we've noticed that in other events, like at Intel, there's a line around the block, and then we decided we'd actually have a check-in system so people can sign up and come in. We know the lines are long because no one really wants to get off the VR when they're playing. But it's, it's a great draw for the, for the event. It's a lot of volunteers, and uh, we, we set up an event so that the kids are happy and that they can come over and over again to see innovation and maybe start to even invent and program some of the things they see in the office.